Family Gateway was formed in 1986 by then Mayor Annette G. Strauss. She formed a task force with nine congregations and they came together to specifically meet the needs of homeless families. Currently, we serve over 4,000 homeless families and 8,000 homeless children. What's unique about Family Gateway is that we don't break up the family. We want to keep the parents together with their children. When we first got here, we've always told them that we wanted stability, and this is what Family Gateway has given us, stability. You know, it's provided housing and helped us with different programs to get into to help us, you know, stay stable and as one as a family. So they gave us a lot of different things that we could do. Which is really what we need the most, because we came here wanting to be a family. That's why we are here together. Without Family Gateway, I, I think I'd be, uh kind of lost without a foundation. I think I'd still be kind of struggling as to where I need to, to go. I'm uh, 46 years old. My uh, journey started with uh, the Family Gateway, I guess about 20 years ago. I found myself homeless, without a job, with no parenting skills. I was having to deal with, raise about three kids. I had a daughter, uh, at the time she was five months old. Another daughter, she was about a year old. My oldest son was about uh, two and a half. So we, we, we just really didn't have anywhere to go after we lost our apartment. Family gave way, opened the doors to get a solid footing on my life. We want to meet the specific needs that the parents have by offering them education, parenting courses, life skills classes, while offering daycare and education courses for the children, after school programming, nutrition classes, family life skills classes. Family Gateway has, has really been my foundation. Uh, as I look back, you know, they gave me that opportunity to, uh, to seize the moment. And I was able to, to get a, um, some education in heating and air conditioning, to be able to, to do what I do, to be a business owner, to uh, have kids who are in college. The name of my business is Bailey's Mechanical. We do heating and air conditioning all over the Metroplex. I attend college at El Centro College. I'm just taking my basics right now, and I'm gonna do psychology at a four-year university after finishing off my basics. I'm currently waiting to go into the Navy. Right now, I'm uh, accomplishing getting my rank up, and I plan on being Admiral in the future. That's my goal, my dream. I'm a one-goal guy, one step at a time. I totally support him and he supports me. That's how we work everything together and we work as a partnership, as you know, being mom and father to the kids. You know, I love being a dad. It's, it's something that's gave me direction. Without my kids, it wouldn't, there wouldn't be a Navy. I wouldn't be thinking about going to the Navy. I'd be all over the place. They sent me and sent them my goals and made, you know, just made me feel like I need to do something. I got to be something. At the Gateway Center, it's our 10 to 15 week program in which the families can come into an apartment and all of their needs are met. And then from there, they can transition to the Gateway Apartments, which is a year long program. We have after school programming for the children and other support services. From there, we can go into permanent supportive housing, which is a five year program with the option to renew for another 10 years so that we can really give those children a chance to get through school, graduate, possibly go on to college. For the adults that perhaps maybe could never get out of that ever-ending cycle of homelessness, those children now have a chance to permanently break the cycle. And what made me want to make a difference is just seeing my, my two little girls, you know, I had to do something for them. I want to do something they can be proud of and give them a, a stable life that I didn't have. I really wanted stability for my kids. I didn't want them to have to experience the same things that me and, you know, the Mondre experience, you know, that's not you know, something that we're really proud of, but you know, we're trying. If you want stability, you have to fight for it, and that just does not come to you. We had to make a decision to come here. Family Do Gateway does give hope. Um, for me, they were hope, because I didn't know where else to go. I didn't know where else to turn. So there, there is hope here. You can find hope here. This program works. We've seen it work, and we've seen those success stories. And we know that when they walk out of those doors, they're not coming back because those dreams are gonna come true.